in the farrowing area, in traditional feeding, we feed the sow two, three times a day. She has an individual feed box, and the amount of food that she gets in a day is limited by two, cat, two things, and that's the number of times a day she's fed and the size of the feed box. However, with today's genetics, that sow is capable of both eating a lot of food, but also producing huge amounts of milk to feed a very large litter. When that sow has that extra demand and she is not given food, two things happen. She takes condition or body store off to keep producing milk because she genetically created to do that. And then she also has that uh, inability to get more food because we don't give it to her. With the unique feeding device, <clears throat> we can provide food 24 hours a day for that uh, sow. She can eat when she chooses, which also is important because most of the time the sow will not be eating while her litter is wishing to nurse. If a pig is getting adequate food, uh, then that pig goes to his warm zone and stays away from mama. So she can very easily get up, consume some more food, and then calmly lie back down without causing a problem with crushing her own babies. And when things are being disrupted, uh, especially with caretakers getting the sow up when she doesn't want to, that can cause some problems for that. So with the feeding 24 hours a day in the farrowing area, that sow is most likely losing less weight, which allows her to go to the next phase of production.